Hi, Julie. Nice to meet you. Hi, Noemi. Nice to meet you too. I saw that you are a doctor taking care of stroke patients when they try to get better. I am a doctor. I'm a doctor because I do research, but I'm also a physiotherapist. What's that? Sounds like a complex word, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, it's a type of therapist who's been trained specifically to help people learn to move themselves again after they've had a stroke. Move their arms and move their legs. Like not being able to walk? Right, exactly that. So we specifically help people who can't walk, who can't balance. And we try to do therapies that help them to get stronger and get able to move again after their stroke. This sounds great, but I believe it is not so easy. It's not easy because when people have a stroke, depending on where it is in their brain, they have a different kind of problem. And so therapists have to specifically work out how to treat those problems. What type of therapies exist? That's a great question. If you can't talk, there are therapists that try and help you regain your ability to speak. If you can't use your arms or if you can't stand and walk, then you have different kinds of therapies. And these are traditional therapies, but now we're also trying new things that help people get more practice with their walking, their thinking, their talking, and that might use robots or even virtual reality. So everyone should come to you to get better. Well, there's lots of different people around that can help people with a stroke. So it's really about finding the right people that can help you. And sometimes it's not as easy to find people in one country as another. So we've got a lot of work to do to try and help people get better after stroke. Thank you very much, Julie. Bye. Bye.